low pH double cleansing routine, then look no further than Puritos From Green. So the From Green Cleansing Oil and the From Green Deep Foaming Cleanser both have a pH of around 5.5, which matches your skin exactly. So if you're Sorry. struggling with subclinical acne or cystic acne and the harsh drying cleansers aren't doing much for you, try these. Um, so I originally switched to this cleansing combination after my skin got excessively sensitive because I was overdoing it on vitamin C serums and acids and all the fun stuff that I like to use. Um, so I had to give my skin a break and how uh, my skin reacted when I overused those serums is I started to get a lot of little red bumps on my cheeks and on my forehead and initially you would think that's acne but it's not acne it's actually your skin reacting because it's under attack its pH is out of whack and its skin barrier is compromised it's actually really hard to tell the difference between the two so you're not quite sure whether you're having a bit of a weird breakout from eating too much Nutella or something like that or if your skin's reacting from an overuse of acids. So the only way that I can tell really is by testing what works. So applying a bit of anti-acne uh, solution on there which usually gets rid of subclinical acne didn't seem to do the trick and my skin was starting to burn as well every time I applied product on. So then I knew it's actually a reaction from my skin's pH being out of whack and my skin barrier being compromised. So I switched over to these two cleansers and the reason why I chose Purito is that they're very clean formulas. So these are both fragrance free, they don't contain any nasties, there's no pegs, no phthalates, no parabens, no nothing like that. Um, and the From Green Cleansing Oil, because I've got acne prone skin, I've found that it's particularly good um, with my skin type. So sort of combination, acne prone, uh, it cleans very well but it doesn't leave a weird residue on your face. Um, and the foaming cleanser, well, it's just a matter of personal preference. So it is a very kind of um, acidic cleanser because it's only a pH of 5.5. But it is also really foaming, so you don't typically find low pH foaming cleansers, they're more kind of the realm of high pH. Um, and I just like foam on my face because it feels like I'm cleaning. Um, so using this after I double cleanse and not letting it rest on my skin for too long generally does the trick and it wasn't burning my skin, it wasn't causing any weird reactions. Using uh, a good toner afterwards, like the TRM uh, Vita B5 toner, which has panthenol in it and soothes your skin, also really helped. So after using this double cleansing duo and the toner and a really good moisturizer, in my case I used SVR Laboratories Top Elise Barrier Cream, um, my skin was on its way to good health again and I could tell my skin's pH was doing a lot better because those little bumps on my face left. So if you're looking for a low pH double cleansing duo that's uber clean, that's cruelty free, you can't go past period. I head over to Canvas Beauty, www.canvasbeauty.com.au and also while you're there check out our Purito buying guide. So we go into detail about all the great Purito products what they do for your skin, whose skin type it suits, their constitution, their ingredients, um, and uh, you make an informed choice before you buy. So have a look at the Purito Buying Guide, and while you're there, have a look at our low pH uh, guide as well. So it's the guide to all things pH. It doesn't make it complicated. It's fairly easy and straightforward.